Alright guys, I'm just going to make a quick video here uh, going over how I've been um, removing the capacitors on the soundboard using an easier method than ones I've seen in other videos of people trying to do the same thing. So this method here, all you do basically is you take a pair of pliers, you grab a sound cap, and lock them on here, and you just start twisting it and just keep twisting it the same direction. So keep going. It's kind of hard to get this one because the uh, this plastic piece is kind of in the way, but you should be able to do it just slowly. Get that my way, cat. All right. Okay, there we go. Oh, there we go. Popped off. So you still have this uh, bottom plastic piece here, so I can probably just get under here real quick with a screwdriver and pop that off. Alright, so here's a close-up look of that one after I removed it. So as you can see, the pads aren't damaged. It looks completely fine right there. So there will still be the legs in there, uh, still stuck in the solder. So basically, when you have your soldering iron, you're just going to have to get the tip of it and like kind of get the legs out, you know, just gently with the tip. Just get them out real quick and, you know, wipe them off on your sponge or whatever. But yeah, this... It's a lot easier than the other methods people are using of, you know, slowly desoldering one leg at a time and kind of wiggling it back and forth. This is much less of a pain in the ass. And I will also put a link in the description of a video from Mr. Carlson, I believe that's the guy's channel, who was the one I saw using this method of removing surface uh, mounted capacitors. So, yeah. That's about it. Just thought I'd uh, share this with you guys.